So here I shall present an example, a bit more complicated example of calculating the energy of photons. Only this time, note that I'm trying to find the energy of a mole of photons and what we're going to do is to find it in terms of kilojoules per mole. So to do this, we want to first figure out for the energy per photon first. Now the energy per photon, we said before is given by hc over lambda, given that we know the wavelength, so this is h, this Planck's constant 6.626 times 10 to the minus 34 joule seconds, c is the speed of light, 3.00 times 10 to the 8 meters per second, divided by the wavelength which needs to be converted to meters. So that's 545 nanometers and there are 10 to the 9 nanometers in a meter and we get 3.45 times 10 to the minus 19 joules per photon. So now that we know this, we need to convert to kilojoules per mole from 3.45 times 10 to the minus 19 joules per photon. Okay, so now we need to do two things. Firstly, we have joules on top, which need to convert to kilojoules. And there are 1,000 joules in a kilojoule. Secondly, let's think about going from photons to moles. We said before that a mole is Avogadro's number of whatever. So I want to convert from photons to moles. There are Avogadro's number, 6.022 times 10 to 23 photons per mole. And so this is how we convert from the number of photons to number of moles. And therefore, if I go through all of this, I find that the energy is 208 kilojoules per mole. 